And we're back. Finally today in New Ephira, First Minister Jin commemorated the 25th anniversary of the end of the Locust War. Today, we are humbled by the presence of two generations of men and women who braved every danger, who fought the battles that made us what we are, including the most pivotal encounter of the Pendulum Wars, Ashbow Fields. Santiago! I'll spare you the inspirational speech, Private. You know what to do. Yes, sir. All right, let's do this. We take down those towers, cripple their communications, then raid the lab. Command wants the Hammer of Dawn, Command gets the Hammer of Dawn. All right, let's move! Move it, Gears! We're only gonna get one shot to extract those plans. Once we take down the comm towers, this entire base is cut off. Yes, sir. You've got Indies! Up top, take them out! Get in the cover! Nice shot! Bonfire. Roger that, Green One. And sweet hell, these are dumb code names. Okay, plan a charge on that tower. Charge planted. Cleaner, our match is lit. Roger that. We're lighting our bonfire in three, two, one. Yes, sir. The lab's just beyond that security gate. Push up! Machine gun nest! We're splitting up! You two take left! We're spotted! Take cover! Get around to the side! 
now. You two, you have the security codes. Override that gate. And with that, this raid is officially underway. Let's go. All right, you know the drill. Eliminate the guards, get inside the lab, grab the plans. Then we ghost. So what does this Hammer of Dawn thing do? It wins the war. And if we do our job right, every system here is wiped, and the indie scientists get an offer they can't refuse. All right, we're in. Let's go. I think so. Move it, Labs up ahead. Uh, Take uh, them out. Come the heck out. I can be speech truck. Yes, your mommy up. Open up on them. Fire in the hole. Push him back! Drag out! Alright, we're in! Time to rendezvous with the Major! Come on! These indie scientists aren't too eager to meet us. Bruce! Be a deer and rip this door! Gears, listen up. If we're not out in ten minutes, abort mission and get the hell out of here. Okay, Santiago, time to meet our new friends. Right behind you, Major. Andy, left side! Hold him back! What's the yard, McDonald? Get in the car! Let me go! Get the 
coming in on the right side! Hold your position! Indy's on the left! Keep him away from the left! Control. Come on, Gears. Colonel Hoffman's convoy is gonna need protection. Corporal, we're coming in hot! Almost there, Control! Oh, shit! That's the convoy! Look out! Look out! Pull those goddamn things! What the hell is even happening? We got this! Oh, yeah!
Kim, sir. Lieutenant Stroud and I need an escort. Congratulations, you're it. Uh, Colonel, we need to get inside. Now. I've got the code for the door, Colonel. Well, good for you, son. Hold these stairs with that hammer. I'll be back when I can. Oh, man! This is bad! All right, you heard the corporal. Don't let him inside! They're coming right at us! Use the hammer! Oh, shit! Look out! Push him back! Push him back! We need some goddamn reinforcements! Not gonna happen! Keep fighting! This is insane! You don't let them near the door! Hundreds of thousands were dead. Emergence Day had earned its name. Like many of you, I was only a child then. It was a dark, terrible time. And our victory was in no way assured. Everyone on that wall! Now! Get that soldier back on his feet! Back in the fight! All right, Gears, get up that ladder! Oi! Come happened? on up! Where the hell am I? During uh, uh. ammo! Shane saw your way out and get on that wall! Let 
Use the turret, numb nuts! I'll cover you! Son of a bitch! Show me what you got! Sergeant Phoenix could be with us here today. Stop and think about the men and women whose sacrifices guaranteed our survival. Thanks to them, we fought through the long twilight. We built a new prosperity. The world the new COG has ensured knows no war, no suffering. It's a world of safety, of family. A world, finally, at peace. Hey, you coming? Just give me a sec. For a butterfly? Yeah, look. You know how this little guy starts out? Trying to stay alive. <laughs> True. But if it survives, and most don't, it finds a way to change. The little larva becomes a chrysalis. Inside, it destroys and rebuilds itself, changing its color, its shape, it gets wings, claws. It slashes its way out of its cage, and then... And then it's new and beautiful. You shouldn't have come. Save your breath, JD. That one, <laughs> she's a mother's daughter. She really is. I really am. We used to protect cock settlements. Now we're about to raid one. Is that ironic? Technically, no. <laughs> Raiding is what outsiders do. Until you two showed up. Now, pff, boring. Better bored than dead, old man. There's a difference. Huh, no alarm. Thank you very much. Yeah, we're not gonna be bored. Dead, on the other hand. That's not the security alarm. Shit, wind flare! We can take cover inside the settlement! To the wagon, all of you! Go! Get inside the settlement! I'm not leaving! 
leaving ugly! Go! need you, right? Raina told Dell and me to do this, not you. Sorry, smart guy. Where she goes, I go. I don't need a babysitter, Uncle. Then call me a chaperone. How about I call you hungover? <laughs> oh, you got some chuff, boy, don't you? Uncle, you're obviously hungover. Actually, I'm still a little drunk. Settlements are built from the inside out, which means the fabricators in the construction hub at the center of town. We grab it, we leave. You can count on a lot of security DBs in there. There hasn't been an outsider raid in six months. We'll have the element of surprise. You can't surprise a robot, my guy. We used to command DBs, remember? Oh, yeah. Like a settlement, too. Hey, that wasn't their fault. You got bigger problems than stubbornness, young one. <laughs> 